this is a recording we're going to talk about uh, kind of the changes to MIMO right now, how you get in and how you share games has changed quite a bit from uh, the game that you've been used to seeing. So I'm going to get in here and Steam and play it. And here we go. Uh, the top menu now, it's the same except I've changed some of the wording. It's career mode as the top level and that'll be the game portion and we'll play the simulation. Sandbox is just to be able to get into all the all the regions and venues and and have events and and do editing together and so on. And then join event will be how if somebody invites you to the game a game that you can join it. So uh, to start with, we're going to Sandbox. That's where I'm doing all my work. And Sandbox again is just brings up all the venues or all the regions. So nine regions, and if you click on one small town. It brings up the four venues inside of the small town, and as you remember, you can make customized versions of each one of these four. So if I click on Park, where I've been working, what it shows is a base venue, and you can have a venue in just the plain old park that's sitting there. Or you can go edit that base park and make a customized version of it, and I've gone in and done that already. I've got one I call Save Chair 1. What it is, I basically added a chair to the base venue. So if I click there, I will, it will kick off an event, or it'll, it'll create a session in Steam uh, for inside of the park, and it'll be inside of the version of the park that's got a chair that I placed in there as a, like a player would. You know, it's not something that I did in the Unreal Editor, but I did it playing the game. And I'll show that at some point. Here's a new part. You click on Event. It says, do you want to invite your Steam friends? Here's your Steam friends. Which ones do you want to invite? And I, this will change over time and get more sophisticated. Like it'll have a picture over here on the left-hand side from Steam. It'll have whether they're online or the, or playing a game or offline, the kind of things that you see in your Steam friends. And then it has a check mark. And so if I say I am going to do the check mark here, now now I'm going to what I, what, I, what you do is you check who you want to send uh, invites to, and then you send the invites now. I'm going to go over to my other machine and start it. Um, I'm starting the recording on the other machine because I want to, uh, and I'm going to get out of here and just get into Steam on the other machine. So that's what I'm doing. And there I am. So I'm, I'm just in Steam uh, in here. Uh, I could have been on, I could have just stayed in the desktop for that matter. But I'm going to send invites, and then everything you'll be seeing uh, from that viewpoint, then I'll we'll look at that other machine uh, video. I will I will splice into this uh, video I'm making. So I send invites, and so it'll send the invites. And I went over to the other thing, and you'll see in the other thing that it, that it invited you to to it down the lower right hand corner. It did. Uh, if I click play, a couple of things I can do. If I click play, it will launch it. We'll just do that. It will launch it, and I can say join event. So if I say join event, it will join the event. It'll say who has invited you. It'll just join to the last event that you saw. So it's joining in the other one, and there I got joined. So I, I joined. Um, just another thing you can see, if I'd have gone in Steam and said uh, what do I want to show here oh no not here I went to the wrong thing if I go down to Steam and say hmm, looking at my friends how do I do that I don't even remember oh friends if I say friends you know it'll show that I'm playing with Music Oasis you know Music Oasis that's where Music Oasis uh, user invited me in to uh, play the game with him. So that's how that looks. Uh, that's a video of where, where it's at right now.